Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, hi my name is Lavinia and I post beauty videos regarding makeup and skincare three times a week, every Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday at 8 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. So if that's something you're interested in, I'd love for you to join my channel by hitting the big red subscribe button. So today we're going to be starting a brand new skincare trial. Today we're going to be testing out some bubble skincare. I am so excited about this. Bubble is a brand new skincare brand that um, targets their products towards teenagers, tackling problems like acne, oily skin a dehydration and just common issues that teens usually see in their skin um, so they have very simple products that are just going to target these issues they're very affordable too so really just marketed towards a younger audience which I find awesome because you know I as a teenager didn't know that much about skincare I'm 19 now um, but back when I was like 13 14 first experiencing these skin issues you know I didn't have a company like this to kind of look at and find some great products so I'm very excited for this so if you guys want to see me try out some bubble skincare, just keep on watching. Oh, you tell me stories. You tuck me in. And the second you leave, I call you right back to check for monsters. All right, so like with all my skincare videos, I always like to get into some product information before we start testing out anything. So they did send these products to me just to test out, but of course I'm gonna be, you know, give you guys my honest opinion on this. We're really gonna be putting them to the test. I find a lot of like teen acne products, they're full of fragrance, full of ingredients that you really don't need. And um, it's really nice to see a company like this come out with, um, as they say here, like clean, gentle, fragrance-free, science-driven, and plant-based. Um, they're sustainable, cruelty-free, and vegan. And they even said they created Bubble to give your skin exactly what it needs and nothing what it doesn't. So like no additives that are really just unnecessary. And it also says pimples always pop, oil always comes back, real skin never looks filtered, and I stand by that 100% never trust any pictures you see online of filtered skin it's all retouched and edited um it's just stuff we deal with not stuff that defines us love that too your acne your um skin irregularities never define you they're just normal it says we're here to support you with skincare that helps you deal with the small stuff so you can put your best face forward even with pimple love that we also have some cute little stickers adorable so here are the products i'm going to be trying out today first of all i love this bag i'm definitely going to use it for traveling and stuff first product we have is the fresh start gel cleanser also love the boxes on these let's open this up and this is what this looks like all their packaging is so adorable and cute i love it um, so let's read a little bit about this fresh start gel cleanser. So this is an everyday cleanser that purifies the skin without drying it out, which is perfect since I have dry sensitive acne prone skin. Don't want anything to overstrip my skin. Um, it's a gel based formula that cleanses away pore clogging impurities while simultaneously smoothing the skin without any harsh ingredients that will strip the natural like moisture of your skin. So that's really good. It's formulated for all skin types free of alcohols, parabens, artificial color and added fragrance which is awesome. So let's look at some of the key ingredients in here. We have spearmint extract, which is naturally gonna refresh the skin, red algae extract, which is supposed to help reduce oil production, um, PHA in here, which is gonna help exfoliate that just top layer of the skin very lightly. We have caffeine as well, which is a great ingredient in skincare to help with like redness, smoothing the skin and kind of depuffing as well. We also have aloe leaf juice, um, which is supposed to provide antioxidant protection and lavender flower water, which is supposed to calm and purify the skin. And the ingredients like look pretty simple. I don't see any like added stuff that I would be, um, you know, worried about. So that's awesome. So let's get to trying this. All right, I'm just in my bathroom now so that we can cleanse the skin. So it says massage one to two pumps into wet skin to create a light foam, then rinse and pat dry, and you can use it both day and night. Oh, I wasn't expecting this to have a pump. I definitely thought you just pour it out. That's some really cool packaging. I've never seen anything like it. So I'm going to do one to two pumps. It's just a clear gel, and it does foam up a little. It doesn't really have a fragrance to it, which is awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse the skin. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse it off now. And just pat my face dry. And there we go. My skin actually feels really cleansed, but not at all stripped. Usually like after I use a cleanser, it's like a little tight, but 
my skin doesn't feel tight at all. So, so far, just first impression wise, I like the consistency of it. I'm definitely gonna continue using this for the rest of the week. Next, we have the Bounce Back Refreshing Toner. And, you know, I did let them know that I have a dry sensitive skin, so they put together their like hydrating set for me. So this is what this looks like right here. Really cool packaging on this as well. And it's actually a spray bottle, which I've never seen a toner come in a spray. So I'm very excited. So this is supposed to be perfect for on the go and it's supposed to give your skin an instant reset um, when oil and shine pop up. You're supposed to just spray it on any time for a quick refresh. Um, it's also formulated for all skin types. We have a green tea extract in here, which is a great antioxidant to help calm and kind of smooth the skin out. We have sodium PCA, which is um, a natural humectant, um, and it's mixed with niacinamide, which is vitamin B3, and this is going to help improve skin texture and reveal a more radiant tone. I use both um, sodium PSA and then niacinamide in my usual routine anyways, so this is awesome. We also have willow bark extract, which includes a bunch of beneficial components which is going to help with gently exfoliating the skin and giving it a more radiant look. So it says to spray three to five inches from the face for an instant reset. All right, so this definitely has rose water in it because I can smell it right away. Um, so that's the only thing I'm a little concerned about because I haven't had the best experiences with rose in the past. But I do like that this is a spray. It's definitely interesting to get it on. And usually with toners, I'll just use my hands instead of like a cotton pad. But this is just really quick and easy to use. All right. And the last product in this routine is going to be the Slam Dunk Hydrating Moisturizer. I am definitely the most excited about this because I hope it just refreshes my skin and gives me that moisture that my dry skin needs. It's supposed to keep the skin calm, cool, collected, and mostly hydrated. Uh, it's supposed to be soothing, ultra hydrating, and um, it's going to help restore the moisture in the skin we have aloe leaf juice in here vitamin e which i love vitamin e and skincare it's such a good um, ingredient to help fight off free radicals and protect against any environmental stressors we also have avocado oil in here which is going to help nourish the skin and blue light protection too which is really cool so this is supposed to help um, from artificial blue light damage like from your phone screen laptop whatever um, it is i see glycerin in here um, we also have a few different oils and extracts. This is what the packaging looks like. And then you just open this up and this is it right here. I love this packaging since it's so, so sanitary because you just pump it out. So let's do, let's do one, two. Oh my God, it looks like a flower. Cute. No fragrance, awesome. Oh, that feels nourishing. It feels like very lightweight, but also like it would really just hydrate the skin, which is my favorite types of moisturizers because I hate when a moisturizer is too thick and heavy and you know your skin's just going to look greasy all day long. Feels great on the skin. Um, my skin definitely feels hydrated right now, but without being too like sticky and already like kind of soaked into the skin, which is awesome. So, so far really enjoying this. All right guys, so that is really the skincare routine with the um, bubble products. I'm gonna continue using all these products for the rest of the week, both morning and night. I don't really have any breakouts right now, just a few spots healing um, that are not active anymore. So hopefully these hydrating products can kind of help uh, my skin heal a bit faster. And then the toner can kind of help just reset that top layer of the skin um we might see improvements so i will keep you guys updated and i'll see you soon hey guys so i'm here just to give you a little bit of an update excuse my hair i just washed it but i already cleansed my skin with the gel cleanser and i'm gonna go in with the toner this is the fourth day that i'm using these products the toner has not sensitized my skin at all yet and then the cleanser i've really been liking too just because it's such a gentle cleanser but even yesterday I was wearing makeup and it was such a good cleanser after my makeup remover to really get everything off so I really enjoyed it now I'm just going to take the moisturizer this is definitely my favorite product in the collection it's such a good moisturizer it feels so good on the skin and it's super lightweight take a bit more my skin has not been dry at all these past few days which is awesome 
And then on top of this skincare routine, I have been using um, my Neutrogena Sheer Zinc SPF as well as the Inculist Succinic Acid. Just of course have an SPF in my routine and then um, some type of acne treatment since there isn't one in the skincare routine. Just put on those other two products. So as I said, I've really been enjoying this routine so far. My skin feels great and I will update you guys later in the week. All right guys, so I just finished washing my face with the um, Fresh to Start Gel Cleanser and it has officially been one week since I've been using these products. So just finished cleansing my skin. I'm gonna start off with the Bounce Back Toner. <laughs> Next is the Slam Dunk Moisturizer, of course. And I usually do a full pump of this. And I also bring it down the neck. And then to finish off my skincare, of course, I use some SPF. I'm just gonna use the Neutrogena um, Sheer Zinc SPF 50. All right, so now that is the end of the week, I do want to give you guys my final review on all these bubble products. Before I do that, I just wanna let you guys know that if you're interested in um, checking out any of these products, I do have a discount code for all of you. Um, it's just Lavinia for 10% off your purchase. Now this code is valid until August 16th, 2021. So if you're looking at checking out um, Bubbles skincare line, you can definitely use my code to get some money off. So let's start by talking about the Fresh Start Gel Cleanse. I really really enjoyed this product I loved how it cleansed my skin so nicely and it was one of those cleansers where it starts off as a gel and as you kind of massage it into your fingers and onto your face it does foam up so you know you're getting a really good cleanse um, even on days that I was wearing makeup this cleansed my skin so well which I was really happy about um, but it didn't leave my skin stripped or dry or just uh, you know dehydrated so I could see how this would work for all skin types and it's just a great like everyday cleanser i used it both day and night i loved it love the packaging too that you have a pump right there so overall really enjoyed this next i want to talk about the bounce back refreshing toner i did enjoy this product i found that it kept my skin you know refreshed and um uh, not dry you know due to some of the like exfoliating properties in here um so i did like that and i loved that it was in a spray bottle so you could just spray it on throughout the day super refreshing too and you could just apply it whenever you want the only drawback i would say uh, for this product in my opinion would be that rose scent in there um it did not sensitize my skin like i haven't gotten any breakouts or anything since i started this video but i will say you know you do want to be cautious about that because um, if you are very sensitive to fragrance, this may cause some sensitivities in your skin. But what I do want to say is I know a lot of people absolutely love the Mario Badescu facial spray and this is the rose water one. I am not a fan of this one. I keep it around for like reference, but I do not use it. It's way too fragrance for my skin. And honestly, it's more of like that nice spray feeling where you feel refreshed, but I don't find that there's actually that many skin benefits to this. So if you're looking for a product like this, where it's that refreshing kind of spray, that mist that you can apply throughout the day, but something that might actually give your skin a bit more benefits and less irritation, then I would definitely recommend this bubble um, toner. I think, you know, if you're looking for that type of spray, you have the rose in there too so this is a better alternative in my opinion if you want a product of that sort so i think this is amazing for summer you know to kind of refresh the skin give you a bit of that boost throughout the day so i did enjoy it but definitely not my all-time favorite product and the last product um to talk about is the slam dunk hydrating moisturizer I absolutely loved this product. Oh my gosh, such an amazing moisturizer. Honestly, one of my new top favorite products that's definitely gonna be integrated into like my everyday routine. I love the packaging too because you can just pump it out. Such a great moisturizer that kept my dry skin hydrated throughout the week, but it didn't, you know, overdo it. It wasn't too greasy. It absorbed right into my skin so nicely, didn't leave like a tacky feeling. My skin always feels super smooth after it, and it just doesn't look greasy or anything. Lays really nicely down under makeup. Um, 
just overall an amazing moisturizer. Definitely one of my new favorite products. All right, guys, so that's it for my Hello Bubble skincare review. I was so excited to try these products and I can't wait to try more from Bubble. I'd definitely be interested in some of the other products I have. And I would love to see them come out with some more like acne type treatments, like whether that be a spot treatment or like some patches or something like that. Cause I feel like teens usually look for those type of products that they can kind of spot treat their acne with. I think we definitely needed a brand like this on the market. And I'm so, so happy um, that I got to try these out and share my opinions with you guys. Um, again, if you're looking to shop any products from Bubble, you can use Lavinia for 10% off until August 16th, 2021. So make sure you don't miss out on that. But that is it for this review video. If you want to see more of my review videos, I'll have my whole playlist linked down below. Um, but if you did enjoy, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and make sure to also hit the bell icon so you get notified every single time I upload a new video. I hope you're having a fantastic day or night whenever you're watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Oh, you tell me stories. You took me